Hey guys, the Elusive Mad here, and today we're playing Project Cat, Paper Lily Prologue. I had found chapter one, and then I realized that there was like a before part. So I was like, well, I have to play this before I play that, and so now we're here. So welcome, let's play. Ooh, the graphics look so cute. I don't think it's gonna actually be cute. All right, so use arrows to move, and Z is okay. This is an interesting garden. Am I in the sky? What's going on? Lock gate. Press Z to interact with the environment. Perfect. Uh. There's a white flower on the ground. Z to pick up items. Take the flower. Sure. Obtained white flower. Yay! X to open the menu and see my items. Fun. Inventory. White flower, flower found on the grass. It appears to be a lily, I think. Ooh, okay. This is cool. Oh, the building ahead seems locked somehow. Weird that you can tell. To use an item, stand close to it and select the item from your X menu. Inventory, select. The flower sank into the water. Oh. Um. Pity. You thought that would work? You should be more careful about the decisions you make. The decision may seem obvious, but... There's always another way. Oh. You may not notice it right away, but your actions will have an impact sooner or later. You may not even remember what you did to cause it. Sadly, regret is always in this shadow of choice. Also, you know very well, this isn't your home. So why do you mess with things that don't belong to you? You're not welcome here. Look! This is the result of your actions. The result of your expectations. Things are not always what they seem. What do you think? Does it still look like a flower to you? You're not prepared to deal with the truth. Are you? But it, it was a it was a flower. Can't stop you from coming here. But if you're foolish enough to cross my path, I'll kill you myself. Such is the way of our world. What a wonderful dream. Well, weird dream. Everyone must be gone already. Looks like it's eleven. I should get to it. Ponytail girl. Oh no! You moved it! I didn't, I swear, you know I hate this type of thing. You can't possibly be happening. It's felt die! Oh my, oh no. Stop drinking around, this is serious. Uh, we should not be playing with this. I told you we're going to get cursed. You dummies! What was that? Is that a ghost? We summoned a ghost. Oh my god. You're making too much noise. Oh, it's just cat. What's the crazy knocking? What was that for? Did that spook you? You're not supposed to be here, you know. I could say the same about you. Why are you here? Actually, say hello to the new member of the occult club. I had the wonderful opportunity to meet all of the members yesterday. I don't recall seeing you there. You three are not part of the club, are you? That's funny, I didn't pin you of all people as the occult type cat. That's cause I'm not. Hey, hey, we're doing something here. I'll save the trouble, all three of you moved it. What, the planchette? For your game, you all moved it. There's no ghost in the room. There's a simple scientific explanation. It's called the ideometer effect. Simply put, it's like your body reacts to pain reflexively. It may also react to ideas and move it on its own. It's pretty much a bypasses the part of the brain which we use for conscious behavior. It's not at all that different from linking or breathing. The effect is even stronger when a bunch of gullible people who are desperate to believe in ghost stories get together and play. 
There was an experiment where the players were blindfolded and suddenly the ghosts could no longer spell messages. You could try it if you don't believe me. In other words, your mysterious answers from beyond are really just your imagination playing tricks on you. Great job killing the mood. You must be fun at parties. Thanks a lot, Kat. Always a pleasure. All right, time to search. I should go over my notes and make sure I don't forget anything. So I need this raven. Crow, my bad. This music is bopping. Interesting choice of decoration. Crows can save your game. Save often since the future is uncertain. The spherical model of the earth. Red crosses mark certain locations. Thick purple book. Spell book, it looks weird. It also looks fake. Cool breeze blows from outside. Close the window. Yes. Objectives. I need three rooms, 12 candles, a lighter, a rune, a tuft of hair, and chalk. Sort the desks in each room. Turn off all the lights and draw the curtains in each classroom. Draw a path going through the three rooms with chalk. In the middle room, place one candle on each desk, lighting the candles and wait at least five minutes. All right, I need to search the school for the first item. The room should be in this room somewhere. You? Crystal ball resting on a cushion. Wow, it's cheap plastic here. It really makes it look authentic. Carbon box is marked with a symbol. These sealed with tape. The room's my friend's bed. Should maybe in here. I need a way to open it. Some chalk here. Take the chalk. Yes. I need chalk. Draw something on the chalkboard. Uh, no, we're not gonna do that. Objectives: gather items for the ritual. So I need a tuft of hair and a rune. The rune I think is in the box, and a tuft of hair I probably needs scissors for. I don't like this already. No running in the hallway while moving hold shift to run, but it's just a no running. All right, let's see. Something like this. Windows, closed curtains, uh, white chalk lines, desk candles on each. I need to move the desks to the sides in all three classrooms that I could draw a path in the middle of each one with chalk. But I'll leave the chalk drawing for last. I want to gather everything I need first. Should I sort the desks in this classroom now? Might as well do it now. Push the desks into the green zones to complete the puzzle. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Yay! That was easy. Okay, so we're not gonna put the candles down. Close the curtain. Ooh, scissors. Shells for the students to place their bags. There's no bags right now, though. Oh, but I wanted the scissors! Oh, there we go, cool. Take the scissors. Maybe I can get a tuft of hair out of the pretty girl. <laughs> I'm kinda scared to run in the hall. Find a way to open the box with the runes, sort desks into their classrooms, and shut the curtain in all three classrooms. <laughs> ah, yay, got hair! What the actual hell? Are you kidding me right now? Oh no. Don't touch her, get out of here! Well, you get out of here. At least I got what I needed. Well, I kinda needed the rune as well. Let's cut this open, hell yeah, so the scissors worked for both. There's a bunch of useless trash in here. This little box may be a little empty. There's three runes, but the ritual doesn't mention a specific one. Should I take B for definitely right? I'm scared. All right, we have to organize this one. Should I sort the desk in the classroom now? Yes. There we go. Easy peasy. Ooh, close all the curtains. Uh-oh, the curtains here are missing. According to the ritual instructions, I need to block out all the rooms. Where will I find new curtains? I need to find curtains? What the heck? Why are the curtains missing anyway? Check this other room. Um, Alright, we're gonna do the desks here as well. I... yeah. There we go. Okay, so the three rooms are pretty good. I'll worry about the chalk in a moment. Any books? Oh, I would definitely steal one of these if they weren't so darn heavy. Encyclopedias. Crazy. They have the globe up here. Some books and chalk. I'll take the chalk. I feel like I might need it. I already have enough chalk, but more the merrier. Hell yeah. 
I never know what might happen, where I might need it. We need more curtains. Is there like an art room? Theater club room, it's locked. Maybe I'll be able to find some curtains here. I wonder if any of the girls is a member. I'm not great terms with them though. How am I going to open it now? Ah, I'll leave downstairs and outside of the school. I should be able to find everything I need on this floor. No need to go downstairs. Okay, so maybe I could talk to one of them and they might give me curtains? What about this way? All right, give up and go home. Ugh, no, let's finish this. There's curtains in here, actually. These curtains are very thin. I don't think they would work. Dang. And my face. Don't talk to me anymore. I won't forgive this. Can you read the room? We don't want you around. Leave. Find some looking radio. Turn it on. What are you even doing? Just looking around. Is there anywhere else that I could get curtains from? Was this here before? This is my desk. Keep it all kinds of cool stuff in here. This might be useful. Take dusty hairpin. Ooh, yeah. So we have a dusty hairpin, which should hopefully help us pick the lock. Run! I should have gone the other way. It's locked. How am I going to open it? I gotta get in somehow. Should I try picking the lock? Yes. Let's give it a shot. Press Z when the indicator matches the green zone. Oh, God. Oof. I'm so screwed. Ah, well, it didn't go as planned. God damn it, no! Pick the lock, pick the lock, pick the lock. I'm usually not this bad at lock picking. Oh yeah, door unlocked. Click! You guys got any curtains? Some legs are sprawled over the floor. They're too heavy to use as curtains. All right, well then I guess I'll use the curtains. Draw a curtain. Yes. Oh, that's a really nice um, painting. There's paintbrushes and stuff in the drawer. Something drawn on it. Where did they find red chalk? Pile of neatly folded drapes. Take them. Yeah, these could be useful. Well, I have curtains. I'm probably gonna double check the other rooms as well to make sure that I have curtains on everything. Perfect. Should I? Well, my lines aren't perfect, but it should do the job. I need to do this in all three rooms. Draw a path in all three rooms, set the light candles in the middle of the room, which is this room. I'm going to make sure I have the lines drawn in all of the rooms. Two down, one more to go. Great, looks good. Let me double check my objective. Set and light candles in the middle room. <gasps> Why? Okay, everything's lit. Everything's ready. All that's left is wait five minutes and then burn the hair. This is going to be such a pain to clean up. Seriously, stop messing with things. But everything I mess with ends up being a scam. What if someday it isn't? What if you end up summoning some ghost or devil and commuting your soul to an eternity in the netherworld? What if your soul is already damned? Then I guess that's what's waiting for me after I die. Cat! <laughs> I'm just joking! We're not gonna find him this way, you know. You'll just do whatever you want no matter what I say, won't you? It's possible. Stubborn idiot. I prefer ambitious idiot. So, will you tell me where the letter is? You exhaust me, cat. You know that? And yet here we are. Fine, you win. It's in the occult club. There's a golden envelope in one of the drawers, but they won't let you sniff around since you're not a member. Thanks, you're the best! Huh? There's somebody at the door? Or not! Objective update! Burn the tuft of hair on the candle, blow out all the candles, close your eyes and count to 100, open your eyes and then... Who knows? I don't like... This... So the books and uh, jars filled with something. Okay, we're just gonna go and burn the hair. It's gonna be fine. Hit 
repair. Let's do it. All right, now I just have to blow up the kettles. They just oh, I guess I should count to one hundred. How am I doing? This ridiculous game couldn't possibly work. Fifty-five, fifty-six, fifty-seven, fifty-eight. I wonder if Mom was worried about me. Huh? What was that? Seventy-nine, eighty, eighty-one. What was that noise? Is anyone there? 97, 98, 99, 100. So I open my eyes. Now oh, you've done, done it. it. It worked? It worked. It worked! I can't believe it! This is incredible. But where am I? It's a hallway? It definitely isn't the school. This is unbelievable. How could it have worked? It doesn't make any logical sense. I was in the classroom a minute ago. Have I gone mad? This is so exciting! I can't believe it worked! I woke up from this and it turns out to be a dream. Wow. That would be disappointing, to say the least. Okay, I definitely need to check this place out. That's oozy. Hold up while moving to climb upstairs. A small door with an odd pattern. It's locked. Door with an odd pattern. It's very locked. <laughs> you don't say. The door with an odd pattern. It's also locked. Everything's locked! Door with a glossy finish. You can see yourself in it. Locked. The way these mirrors sit on the wall, it's almost comforting. But staring into mirrors in a place like this, it's almost like I'm asking to be jump scared. This is where I started, this is where I started, so it goes in a big loop. Do you work? A fairly normal looking door, also locked. Black substance drips down from here. Where's this stuff coming from? Uh. Oh, um. Am I lost? I don't remember this hallway being so long before. There's a key hanging from a hook. Yes. Obtained fairly normal looking key. So that probably goes to one door, which is up the stairs. Run! Run! The key fits before proceeding through the door. Do you wish to save? Yeah, if you're giving me the option to, I might as well. Huh? What's this? Am I back at school already? I don't think this is school. Let's have some fun, shall we? Entertain me for a while, and in return, you get nothing. Huh? Who's talking? Uh. Do you even know where you are? You chose a one-way trip to hell, kid. Where are you? Well, if you're not gonna help, then be quiet. I'll leave once I find what I came for. Yeah, we're just here to give what we need. Which is these. Unsealed golden letters scattered across the floor. They seem to be rituals with various titles. Mirror ritual, the ritual of the well, the bus ritual, the three room ritual. That's the one I did. These all come in golden letters. Do they all work? I should look into this when I get home. We're leaving, we're leaving, we're leaving, we're leaving. You think you can leave? Now that you can prove these rituals work, you have no way of going back to tell anyone. The knowledge will die with you. That's that's a lie, right? You're just trying to scare me? We're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Are you lost? Oh, I really don't want to go back down. Oh, I really don't want to go back down. This wasn't like this before. Oh. You should give up. You will never leave this place. I don't like this. Why? Your mother will be devastated from that she's now completely alone. 
No husband, no daughter. Everybody left her. How pitiful. How dare you say something like that? You know nothing about me. You couldn't tell your father goodbye back then, and now you won't get to tell your mother goodbye either. These letters are mean. What if I told you that someone you know is in here with you? Would it that make you hopeful? Relieved? Potentially, but they might also be stuck here with me. You know you're thinking you can escape with them. But these rituals have no way back. They were never designed that way. After all... Why would you give your prey an escape? I know more about you than you think. Let me show you something. Huh? This is a painting of a vague memory. Oh. No. Val of Souls Elf. It's too hazy to read. <gasps> oh! This one is this place? Oh god, okay. Oh, uh, we're gonna... We're gonna... So what do you think? I can see everything that's in your head. You really should make an effort to be more lively. You only have until I decide I'm done playing around with you, you know. And then... Snap. Uh... Uh... Okay, we need, we need to get the fuck out of here. I don't like this, I don't like this, I don't like that I'm going in. Just keep going, just keep going, just keep going, just keep going, just keep going. Oh. How would you like to stay trapped in here until you die? Oh. Uh. Um. Do you like it? I think it's just what you need. Maybe now you could reflect on the stupidity of your actions. In the meantime, I'll just watch you rot away. Shut up, that's enough! Whoever you are, get out of my head! My life is my business. My decisions are my own alone. Let me out of this place. I know there's a way out. There has to be. Please. I want to go home. That's more like it. Oh no, I'm scared. I'm back in this hallway. I don't like this. I need to get out of here. This is fun. I need to find a way back. Door with an odd pattern. I need a key, I think. I don't like that that one's open. Okay. This door is open. Isn't it boarded up? Everything else is locked. I have no other choice but to go in. I don't like the look of this. Well, a beheaded corpse. That can't be. How is it possible? I just saw her a while ago. I, I don't understand. Oh. A bloody corpse. No, 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 no. Oh my god, this can't be real. This is not real. Right? Bloody corpse. The lower half is missing. I... This is my fault. I don't think it can be this easy. A welcoming door. It's locked. I have to get out. Unfortunately, the door has no keyhole. The door? I can leave? I can go home. I feel like it's not really... I don't want to die. The end!
end. Oh, okay. This was really good. I'm wondering how many endings there are, considering choices matter. You don't even know where you're gonna mess up to make a choice. Maybe it's like picking up the second piece of chalk. I don't know. If you guys have played this as well, like let me know what endings you've gotten or like what I could have done differently to get different endings. I'm also planning on doing the first chapter. So like, if you like this, check that out as well. I will leave a end card thing for that when I do finally release that. But until then, check out this other... <laughs> Check out this other video that's also very good. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.